Hi, I'm going to show you how to set up servos on an Ultraborg so they power up in a safe place. This could be in the centre of the range of a servo or it may be at one end or really anywhere in the servo's range. We will also want to set up the limits for the servo so you don't try and drive the servos past where their end stops are. If you don't set these you could potentially damage a servo or you at least might be using more power trying to drive them past where they're happy to sit. So, to get started we open the Ultraborg tuning GUI. In the GUI, each of the four servos are listed with sliders. The far left slider here corresponds to servo 1 position. So, these sliders are not very restricted in their range. Think of them as super user sliders, where we can potentially tell the servo to do silly things the servo isn't capable of. If I was to move the slider all the way to the top, I'd be telling servos to wind around past their end stop, so we need to be a little bit careful here. Take some time, move the slider up slowly. What I'll do is I'll watch the servo closely as I'm slowly moving the slider upwards. What I'm looking for is the point where the servo no longer moves or where I can hear it struggling. Keep moving to where it stops, come back ever so slightly so we're still in the moving range. Once we're happy we're at the end but we're still in the moving range, we'll hit the save maximum. Now we'll do the same at the other extreme. We'll move the slider down slowly until it no longer moves and come back a little bit and hit the save minimum. As you can see above the save buttons it shows the position which is saved. Ok, now we can set the position we want the server to start up in. So, say the entire system is powered down. When we apply power to the PIC microcontroller on the Ultraborg, it will tell the servos where to position themselves. When power is applied to those servos, the servo will immediately start servoing to that startup position. You can put this position anywhere within the range you just set. In this case, I'm going to put it approximately in the middle and click the Save Startup button. OK, we can repeat this for servos 2, 3 and 4 if you have them. We should in theory only need to do this once. When we've done this and set up the servos, we'll want to use the Ultraborg demo GUI to move the servos about rather than the tuning GUI. So I'll open the Ultraborg demo GUI up. Now when we want to go to 100% the servo moves to the max limit we sent. When we tell it minus 100% it goes to the minimum limit. Right, so now I'll position my servo to somewhere I know isn't its startup position. I'll turn off all the power and watch the servo as I reapply power to the Ultraborg. Even though the Raspberry Pi hasn't booted up yet, it still goes to the servo's position that I just set for startup.